Today we are going to see a very important tricky topic uh, in dealing with sheets, which is how to change the language and what it affects. Maybe it's very simple subject to say that it's easy, I can change the writing language, but it's having some more complications if you need to change the menus language or the, the sheets handling language and what is changed and what is not changed. If you remember, that's the, the main uh, sheets page. You'll find the link in the uh, bottom uh, in the description with many other useful resources and trainings for you. If you go to this sheets main page, you will find the settings. If you go to the settings here, you'll find only the right to left uh, con uh, controls. You don't find here any global settings uh, for uh, your sheet. So if you go inside the sheet, if you remember that's our famous sheet that we had done a lot of great things using it. If you go here to file, you will find here the settings. If you go to the settings, you will find from here on the language. If you just clicked on the display, if you click here, it will take you to the language, but not the language only of the sheets. It is the language of your uh, Google account. You can see here that's your go language of your Google account. So everything in your Google account will be changed to this language if you uh, decided to change the language of all the Google services and all the menus in the sheets and so on. So you need to be mindful while changing it. If you are used to the menus and so on in the English and you can use them in the English, that's okay. If you need to change them, you can change them from here, but changing them will change all your Google account menus into English because this page is for the Google account and not only for the sheets. That's one of the very important tricks. I can show you one other sheet that we had. I had moved it to completely Arabic. Okay. So in this sheet and in, in this other account, I had moved it completely to Arabic. To, to, so you will find all your menus in, in Arabic. So, and uh, if you come here, it depends on your zoom. If I decrease the zoom a little bit, it's 110. You can decrease it from here, the zoom. Okay. You can see here that's the right left direction of the writing. So you write from the right to left or right to in. We have in the world about eight or 10 languages that are written from the right to the left. The most popular one is uh, Arabic. Okay, you have the Ordo and the uh, other languages and Hebrew and, and so on. But here you change the complete sheet from right to left if you need to change the complete sheet. But anyhow, because you had selected the language of your uh, Google account into uh, Arabic, then all the menus, you will find all this one in Arabic or other language that you had selected. When selecting to change the language, that's a very important one. For example, I changed, I was I selected for you here, for example, I need to change to Portuguese. When you change to Portuguese, it asks you about the dialect. Arabic language, you have the Egyptian, you have the Syrian, you have the uh, Gulf, and in the uh, Portuguese, you have the Brazil, Portugal delegate. The uh, Angola, they are speaking. Uh, I don't know if they are speaking Portuguese. That's new information for me. You have uh, Mozambique, it's having a speaking uh, also Portuguese, and they have their own of Portuguese. So it's not only the uh, Portugal that is speaking uh, Portuguese. You have that of all the countries that is speaking with this language, like you do with the Arabic. Okay. And you will find all the menus in, uh, in the Arabic. Okay. If you change, if I change it to, ch uh, I decided to change it, for example, to Brazil. Okay. Uh, and I selected the, the Brazilian. You will find that the language is changed to the Brazilian one completely. You can change it back from here, select changing that the, the language. And uh, of course you can uh, promote the other languages. If you have other languages on the top, on the bottom, you can uh, promote uh, or this language to be the, the top one. Okay. And if you go here, if you renew your sheet or uh, refresh your sheet, you'll find that everything is changed now to the Portuguese language of the Brazilian delegate that you had selected it. Okay. And, uh, but the, the, the idea that you will find that the languages itself, that the, the languages itself uh, of the, what you are using, it is the same English language, for example, so I, when I use some, it is some. All the functions are written in uh, in English and their uh, description is also given in, in, in English. But what you will find changing is the help that is available on them. So if you have help in this language, you will find that the help, if I claim as, uh, for example, some, this one, okay, uh, plus this cell, okay. Enter and uh, you go to this cell again, come back to this cell, 
okay you can find here that you have the description what is inside is in your local language and the help is on your local language but anyhow the function itself as written it's forever whatever the language is the sum and it's giving the notation of the uh, letters in the sheet and the letters in the, sh in the sheet uh, which are marking the columns are never changed to any other language so this was a very important note on changing the language so just mind yourself when you are changing the language you are changing the language of your complete google account thank you for watching see you in coming important notes and tips and tricks from sheets